Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So according to a new experimental flag that's become available in Chrome Canary 135, which is the latest preview version, Google is working on a new look for the delete browsing data menu and dialog in the early preview version of Google Chrome. And currently in the stable version, this is what the dialog and menu looks like. So you've got your basic with browsing history, cookies and other site data, cached images. So that's what you can delete. So that's what you can delete in your basic options. And advanced, you get browsing history, download history, cookies and other site data, cached images and files, passwords and other sign-in data, autofill form data, site settings, hosted app data. Now, this is exactly what the delete browsing data dialog looks like in the stable version. Now in Google Chrome Canary 135, the latest preview version, if we just head into our experimental flags page and we type in revamped, this is the experimental flag which I'm referring to, revamped delete browsing data dialog. The description reads, enables a revamped delete browsing data dialog on desktop. This includes UI changes and removal of the bulk password deletion option from the dialog. Now I've already enabled the flag, but as you can see, nothing is actually changing with the user interface. So I haven't spotted any front facing user interface changes as yet. But one of the biggest changes according to the description of that flag, is the removal of the option to delete all your saved passwords at, at the same time, so at once. So currently you can delete all your passwords through the dialog by selecting passwords and other sign-in data under the advanced settings, as you may well know. Now there could be a good reason for this, with this change, because the removal of this option could indicate that Google wants you to manage your passwords through the Google Password Manager settings instead. So if we just head over to our Password Manager, this change could not only offer more control and security features because obviously, because to remove passwords or change passwords from the Password Manager, you have to go through a lot of security options. So it could also help prevent accidental password deletion if you make a mistake as an example or you didn't realize you clicked the option um, in the delete browsing data dialog. So although it might involve a couple of extra steps, I actually think this is a nice move in the right direction. I just, I just think it makes the accidental deletion of your passwords a lot less. So as mentioned, the Changes haven't been spotted yet when it comes to the user interface and the removal of this option. But obviously when that becomes available and I can actually show you something in real time, I'll post and let you guys know. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.